As designer, our first priority is to design not only attractive, but as well authentic car. The aerodynamic design of the front and roof section give the car an elegance, but as well very high quality. The focus on aerodynamic helps us to not just reach attractive design, but as well the reduction of all the parts. We got clean up everything from the car to just make something very clean, very attractive and very stunning. Even details as the door handles are fully integrated in the body. The entire design is free of unnecessary decorative elements. The model is unmistakable a member of the ID family. It's stylish, with flowing lines and pure aerodynamic, with character and of course elegance. Rue的空气动力学设计有助于降低能耗，风阻系数低至零点二三，车内空间无需丝毫妥协，续航里程可达六百二十公里。What a sleek, cool-looking car, ladies and gentlemen. The ID Aero is a show car. However. It gives a pretty accurate preview of Volkswagen's first global all-electric sedan to come. Being almost 5 meters long, it belongs to the high-volume mid-size sedan segment, which saw China sales of over 2.5 million in 2021, or 12.1% of the total market. I think it's fair to say that mid-size sedans are a crowd-pleaser, and the ID Aero will further electrify this segment with this progressive, stylish, aerodynamic design that doesn't compromise on roominess. Coupled with the MEB, which provides long-range, dynamic driving behavior, new levels of digital networking and over-the-air update capability, the ID Aero will be Volkswagen's flagship ID model. The China Series production version will be unveiled in early next year, with deliveries starting in the second half of 2023. And as with all our best sellers, we will offer the car in not one, but two attractive versions. One from Ichi Dajung and one from Shanxi Dajung. <laughs>